Amid the COVID-19 pandemic, one structure that has garnered attention is the enigmatic doomsday bunkers. These structures, which originated during the Cold War between the US and Soviet Union, have been regarded by some as the ultimate solution to surviving a potential apocalypse. Typically constructed with reinforced concrete walls or carved into mountains and equipped with thick steel doors, these bunkers are evolving beyond mere survival spaces to become symbols of luxury. We have compiled the top 10 most luxurious nuclear bunkers. The luxurious doomsday bunker called Oppidum, first on our list, can be found in the Czech Republic in Europe. It is surrounded by mountains and has everything you need for both work and play, all spread over a whopping 323,000 square feet. You can choose to stay in a 6,750 square feet apartment or one of the six 1,720 square feet apartments. There's also a golf course at ground level and a helipad. Inside the bunker, you'll find a five-star restroom featuring a whirlpool bath, double sinks, and rainfall showers, a spa, swimming pool, garden that replicates natural light, cinema, library, billiards room, conference and communication rooms. There's even a gym, bar, wine cellar, and a hospital with a dental surgery facility. Of course, you'll also have access to water, air, electricity, and food. Oppidum can provide for its residents for 10 years, and it is designed to keep them safe from nuclear attacks. Vivos Group is one of the rapidly expanding companies focused on building doomsday bunkers that can provide safety against a range of catastrophes, such as nuclear and bio wars, terrorism, anarchy, electromagnetic pulses, solar flares, pole shifts, killer comets, global tsunamis, planet collisions, and volcanic eruptions. A whole lot of stuff you don't want to be near. Situated in Rothenstein, Germany, the Vivos Europa 1, the second on our list, is nestled within a 400 feet high mountain spread over 76 acres above and below ground, and is considered one of their premier facilities. Number three was previously a military fort. The Europa One has been transformed into a private apartment complex with 34 living quarters that are each around 2,500 square feet in size. These subterranean living spaces are customizable and can include kitchens, deluxe bathrooms, bedrooms, dining and living rooms, swimming pools, gyms, theaters, and even a bar, depending on the buyer's requirements. With thick concrete shells and impenetrable steel doors, the units are designed to provide top-notch protection. The Vivos Group also owns a train depot, helicopters, and cars, which enable quick and easy access during an emergency. Overall, these luxury doomsday bunkers offer all the comforts and grandeur of a lavish mansion, but built underground for unparalleled security. Kansas, the location of the fourth bunker, is home to a place called the Survival Condo. It was made out of an old missile silo that belonged to the U.S. government during the Cold War. This underground structure has 15 floors and can protect people from a nuclear bomb that is 100 times as powerful as the one that was dropped on Nagasaki. The bunker is 201 feet deep and has lots of cool things like a place for dogs to walk inside, a shooting range, a place to climb rocks, an indoor pool to swim, a water park, a library, a movie theater, a bar, a gym, and a room for medical emergencies. All of this is for the guest of the bunker. There is also a command center so people can stay in touch with the outside world and stay informed. There are backups for power and water storage that can last for five years. The people who live here can grow plants using special lights to stay healthy. There are also LED lights that help people feel like they are outside during the day. This helps a lot with mental health in these bunkers. Trident Lake is the fifth on this list. It's a big and fancy doomsday bunker that covers an area of 700 acres. It's more like a resort than a shelter, with 600 places to live, a golf course, a big gym, fields for playing polo, and seven places to play indoor or outdoor sports. There are also places to go swimming and do other water activities, places to go shooting, and 12 places 
to park helicopters. The people who built Trident Lake were thinking ahead and made a DNA vault just in case something really bad happens. There is a huge fountain that is 55,000 square feet and it looks very fancy. Almost the entirety of the bunker is underground and it faces a body of water to make things less stressful. The living spaces inside the bunker can be very small or very big, depending on what the people who live there want and need. For our sixth, the underground Las Vegas bunker doesn't look like a normal bunker. Instead, the entrance is made to look like rocks that blend in with the surrounding area. A clever idea to hide the location. The bunker is huge, exactly 14,620 square feet, and it's 26 feet below the ground. The house that sits on top of the bunker acts as a shield to keep it safe. The inside of the bunker looks like it was built during the Cold War, and the kitchen has old-fashioned equipment. The yard outside has concrete columns that have been made to look like trees, so it feels more natural. Inside the bunker, there is a spa, a pool, a place for guests to stay, a big fountain, a nightclub with a bar, a BBQ, five bedrooms, and six really nice, luxurious bathrooms. The lighting follows the movements of the sun, making sure the place feels like the outside. The Aristocrat is a doomsday bunker made by the Rising S Company. It takes the seventh spot. It's their fanciest one. It can fit up to 50 people, and it has a sauna, swimming pool, gym, game room, bowling alley, and theater. Everything you could want to stay entertained and comfortable. It also has a big garage that can fit multiple vehicles, a gun range, and high-end dining and living areas. It's definitely a luxurious bunker. The eighth, the safe house is unique because it's actually above ground, and it has windows made of glass to let in natural light. Even though it looks like a big block of concrete from the outside, it feels much lighter inside when the windows are open. The windows are large concrete blocks that can be closed up during an emergency, and there are metal walls that can be rolled down over the glass if needed. The structure is different but is just as strong as the others. The house is 6,100 square feet and has a swimming pool and an outdoor theater that uses the metal shutter as its screen. The patio has a really high ceiling, so it's bright and breezy, and there's a retractable bridge that connects the terrace and the swimming pool, which breaks up the blocky shape of the house when you look at it from the outside. Inside the house, there are four bedrooms and four bathrooms, as well as a spacious living room and kitchen. The bedrooms are all located on the upper level, while the living room and kitchen are on the lower level. The kitchen has a large island and high-end appliances, and the living room has a fireplace and plenty of seating. One of the most unique features of the safe house is its security system. The house is protected by a variety of high-tech security systems, including bulletproof windows, motion sensors, and cameras. There are also panic rooms hidden throughout the house, which can be accessed through secret doors. The safe house was designed by KWK Proms, a Polish architectural firm. The firm specializes in creating modern, innovative buildings that are both aesthetically pleasing and functional. The safe house is a perfect example of this philosophy, as it combines cutting-edge design with state-of-the-art security features to create a one-of-a-kind living space. Vivosex Point is a huge bunker community in South Dakota. This large group of bunkers is coming in at the ninth place, covering an area even bigger than 3-4 of Manhattan. It has 575 bunkers made of strong material like steel and concrete, and is strategically designed for safety and privacy. Each bunker can fit between 10 to 24 people and has about 2,200 square feet of space. They are 12.5 5 feet high, 26 feet wide, and are located 400 feet away from their neighbors in all directions. These bunkers have kitchens, living rooms, dining areas, multiple bedrooms, and even gyms, which can be customized to what you want. The rooms are very fancy and comfy. The last on our list is the Greenbrier Bunker, also known as a Doomsday Bunker. It used to protect the U.S. Congress during the Cold War. Located beneath the West Virginia wing of the Greenbrier Hotel, the bunker was hidden and kept a secret for many years. However, it was eventually exposed in a Washington article and was retired after that. The bunker featured two meeting areas that were designed to seat a total of 535 Congress members. The walls of the bunker were painted 
constructed in a way that reflected the different seasons of Washington to make the space feel like the outdoors. Each entrance was equipped with decontamination showers to protect against contaminations from nuclear attacks. Also, the most advanced medical technology was always on hand when the bunker was in use to care for its occupants. Those are the most unique and outstanding bunkers we found. If we missed any that you'd like to see in a future video, let us know. If you have any questions, ask away in the comments. And please don't forget to subscribe and turn on bell notifications to never miss out on another upload. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.